it's this thing called pishing. It's like a secret bird technique. Yeah. Songbirds will usually respond just by kind of popping out and looking and see what's making it. My name is Mason Marin, and I'm a wildlife photographer. There's definitely kind of parallel between good places to get photos of wildlife and places that there are a lot of people. For example, Edmonds, you know, along the Puget Sound is a great place. You think the birds are scared, they just kind of hang out in front of you. The Mount Rainier is obviously a great place in the Olympics as well. There's a lot of really cool habitat up there, which makes for really nice photos. And there's also, those are kind of the areas where you're going to see a lot of big mammals. I like to get photos of mammals, to marmot and ground squirrel and stuff like that. They're a lot tougher. And we went out to Nisqually National Wildlife Refuge and then out to Westport out on the coast. And we saw this coyote uh, walking in the grass right when we got there, kind of like walking back through the grass and peering back at us. But they're surprisingly hard to find versus birds are kind of everywhere. It's right there, song sparrow. Gal, you want some more food? No matter where you are, there's always a subject to shoot. I went to Mount Rainier and I saw some white crown sparrow, Stellar's jays, Canada jay. Beyond that, down here, I had Anna's hummingbird, common yellow throat, song sparrow, dark eyed junco, spotted toby is a really fun one. Recently, I got western screech owl, which was really cool because they're really small owls, they're really tough to see. Personal favorite of mine is usually Cooper's hawks because they're kind of these really slim, small hawks and so they're really tough to find, but they kind of make for really cool shots. On Instagram, I posted a photo of sooty grouse, which I saw up in Mount Rainier, which was amazing. I've been looking for grouse for like three years now. The number one challenge is just timing and luck because you never know when you're gonna get a good shot and you never know when you have a perfect shot right in front of you. And you oh, when I know I get the shot, it makes the whole thing count, right? If you spend five hours out walking around in the middle of nowhere trying to get a shot and one bird shows up, but you know that you got that shot in that moment, it makes the whole day worth it. So impressive. You can check out more of Mason's portfolio on his website or his Instagram and the links are on our website, king5evening.com. <laughs>